guys it's Vanessa and welcome back to my channel so in today's video I'm gonna be showing you how I achieved this big voluminous braid out this is the second time I'm filming this and I like these results a lot better so if you want to see how I got this look then please keep watching so I'm starting off on stretched hair and I'm just gonna go ahead and divide my hair into four different sections using my satin scrunchies I love these <music> So once I've done that, I'm going to go ahead and use my leave-in conditioner from Organic 7. And I love this conditioner. It's super creamy. It's made with nettle and rosemary extract, which gives it an amazing smell. And it's meant to strengthen elasticity, prevent breakage, and promote hair growth. Next, I'm going in with the main choice Pearly Braid Out Glaze. This is a part of their Tropical Moringa line. And I love this stuff. As you can see, the consistency is kind of sticky. Um, but it smells oh, amazing, you guys. Kind of reminds me of vacation. Um, but yeah, as you can see, I'm just applying that to the section. This product is supposed to deliver amazing definition and flexible hold. Restores and locks in moisture minimizes frizz and helps to reduce breakage as well a quick tip for you guys to ensure that you have a bomb braid out is to make sure that once you apply your product you are smoothing out the product with a denman brush or any kind of brush that works well for you but smoothing out of the product definitely helps to get great definition i've heard nothing but great things about this product so i am excited to be using it today for this braid out and I'm just going to go ahead and start braiding my hair, you guys. That's pretty much it. I'm going to continue this process all around my head, and I'll check back when I'm done. Once I was done braiding my hair, you know I had to bring out the Miel Organics Mint Almond Oil. I love this stuff. It's my favorite oil. It smells amazing and does a great job at sealing in all the moisture. So I kept these braids in for about a day and a half. I actually did go out in public like this. I know, crazy, right? Never again. But anyway, <laughs> these are my braids. I'm just adding a little bit more of that oil from before. And I'm starting to take out my braids one by one. I was extremely pleased, you guys, with the definition that I got using the braid out glaze. I was just amazed. Also, my hair was extremely, extremely soft and felt moisturized as well, which I believe was due to using that leave-in conditioner from before. Wow. Do you see the definition? Like, do you see that shine? My hair looks so good. Oh, 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 oh,
This is my hair with the braids taken out and separated. Now I'm going to go ahead and grab my pick and start fluffing out my hair for some extra volume. I always make sure to pick from the root and to not pick all the way through my curls because that will ruin them. And that is it for this braid out tutorial. I really hope you guys enjoyed. I love the results that I got from using both the leave-in conditioner and the braid out glaze. I definitely will be using these products for future styles. And yeah, I just love the way my hair came out, guys. Everyone, please stay blessed and I will see you in my next upload. Bye, y'all.